Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the video, I'm Get Good Guy, and today I'm going to be talking to you about an alternative medic counter for the Assault class. Because most of us are aware of just how dominant medics can be at a variety of ranges these days, so finding ways to compete with them when you're using another class is vital. Obviously, when playing Assault, you can go for the almighty Ribeiro Le for great range capability, but there is also another option, with its own strengths and weaknesses when compared with the Ribe. That weapon is the M1917 trench carbine, a weapon that sees very little usage, likely due to its perceived weakness before the TTK patch, and I did talk about the weapon at that time, which will be linked to in the description if you'd like to see what I thought of it back then. But now, if you have a fast trigger finger, then this could be a valuable option in the right scenario. Are you tired of being outshot at even slightly long range by a medic? Give this a try. The trench carbine can fire at 359 rounds per minute and has fantastic recoil and spread stats. It's actually got the same rate of fire and damage numbers as the M1903 Experimental of the Scout class, which is also a much improved weapon these days. And this might make you ask, well why choose the carbine over the Experimental then? Well besides the superior muzzle velocity, the trench carbine spread stats are actually just that good, far outstripping those of the M1903 Experimental, with only slightly worse recoil. And as you can see, the recoil is essentially non-existent anyway. That, combined with those exceptional spread stats and better iron sights in my opinion, means you can rely on this weapon to consistently hit the target from basically any range if your aim is on point. And I'm sure you're aware that that's one of the main things that medics have over other classes currently, the ability to spam fire and still hit the target. While the trench carbine can do the same whilst having great close range lethality, 3 bullets to kill out of 12 meters, and that can be achieved regularly with hip fire if you wish, as again those spread stats come into play. Now as stated, a fast trigger finger and good aim are essentially requirements to use this weapon well. So it won't be for everyone, and the Ruby Relay will likely be an easier option for most. It's less accurate, but it's fully automatic, so there's a trade up there for which you prefer. Regardless, sometimes you can do some really good work with the Trench Carbine, often aided by a, for a semi-automatic weapon, pretty huge 41 available rounds per reload. Now obviously it's not going to dominate at any set range, much like when I recently talked about the BAR Telescopic, this weapon is essentially just solid at everything, allowing you to not be massively outclassed by a different weapon, regardless of what you're doing. It does require 7 bullets to kill from 33 meters out, and it will be at a disadvantage at close to mid range when facing an auto loading extended, for example, because some guns are just top of the meta at the minute and you can't really alter that. But overall, the trench carbine might help you out if you happen to be struggling as assault on a more open map. If so, your job will be made a whole lot easier if you can hit some headshots when taking someone on, especially at longer ranges. And this is very possible due to how steady the weapon is and how how straight the bullets fly. I imagine on PC it will be even easier to achieve as you have the opportunity for pinpoint accuracy with a mouse. So placing your crosshair on a distant stationary enemy can see you land multiple shots to the dome very quickly. Personally, I think the M1917 trench carbine is a good option to have in your playbook. Although it's certainly not top tier, it's far better than it used to be and just keep it in mind next time you're in a bad spot and need a new option. But this is all just my opinion. What do you think? Do you like the trench carbine? Will you try it out now and do you have another medic counter strategy? Let me know in the comment section below. Now let's quickly shoot over to the board of awesome for those fantastic people who support the channel on Patreon, allowing you to get content full time. It's super appreciated. If you want to join them on the board then the link to the Patreon page is in the description and in my pinned comment. Donations can be as low as $1 a month and I hope you enjoyed the video. Remember to turn on notifications so you don't miss future videos and feel free to like, share and subscribe. I'm Get Good Guy and I'll see you next time, laters.